work into the bowl, Ben feels that the learning environment. We've been doing lots of work in the bowl this year, making the most of our outdoor space. Come on into the bowl and see what we've been getting up to. We do our collective worship outside. We enjoy listening to the sounds of our environment while reflecting on the Bible stories we have heard. It's a great opportunity to come together as a user of Bible. using chimes and calming scripts read by our teachers. This helps us to be ready to learn. Mrs. Norman has been hiding multiplication questions for us to find an answer. We have been using our whiteboards and asking our friends numbers to round to 10 and 100. Can you round 63 to the nearest 10? It is 60. Can you round it to the nearest 100? It's 100. We have been working hard to learn our times tables in year 4. We practice TT rock stars every week and try hard to beat our soundtrack school. We also have time tables today to help us learn our time tables. Sometimes Mrs. Mystery asks us for the answer. We have a new time table every day. Make sure to ask us when you pick us up from school. This is Fenna and this is Norman has taught us Mr. Tusman's time table game. Here's the game. Two times two is four. Uh, two times five is ten. We have started to look at Robin Hood and build descriptive sentences about him. The bowl looks just like Sarah's voice. In, we have been using expanding now phrases and conjunctions to add detail to our work. The sly brad and grim was the look on Robin Hood's face when he, when he thought of a cunning plan. His face shot sharp arrows shot through the air um, and he pulled his deadly steel sword out of the tree stump. His brown chocolatey hair flew through the wind. If we have worked hard and completed all our activities, we have a few minutes free time in the bowl. This is when we can use our imagining muscle and creative muscle. We have created a new game, a new game called Hit and Stick. We have to use three people for it, a bowler, a hitter and a catcher. We need acorns, a log to sit on and a stick. Well, so we are going to model the game for you. I'm, I'm the thrower, this is the hitter and this is the catcher. We throw the acorn and the person that's hitting it hits, hits the acorn with the stick. And the catcher has to try and catch the acorn for 50 points. our own versions of Scarabray using stones.
see an underground bunker. You can see my one here actually is all dirty because archaeologists had to dig it up. But also because it's been left there for years. We make leaf rubbing and sculptures from natural resources. In guided reading, our book this time is Edward Trelane. We are very enjoying learning more about Edward and his adventures. We used to test the help of straw Edward looks like. We labelled our pictures with evidence from the text. I've drawn long for the ears because in the text it says his ears were made of real rabbit fur. I have drawn long whiskers because in the text it says his whiskers were long and elegant as they should be. I have drew, I have drew dark blue intelligent eyes because in the text it says his eyes were dark blue and intelligent. I have drawn a suit because in the text it says handmade silk suits. Our history to book this time is Romans and we are lucky enough to have some artifacts kindly donated by Fobbs. We looked at the artifacts to try and guess what they might have been used for. Here are some of our favourites. This is a sponge on the stick. Romans use this to clean their butt because well we do have toilet paper. And it's kind of gross because it's for some reason it smells like it. This is some Roman's wooden tweezers, Roman ear cleaner, and Roman nail sharpener. This is a Roman coin. They used it to appear a very long time ago. This is a Roman spoon. They used to use it to eat big feasts. This is a Roman sword. They used to use it in Roman times when they battled. This is a Roman helmet. They used to use it to protect their head in battles. This is a baby bottle. They would have put the milk through here and the babies would have drank from here. We have also been looking at our Roman mosaics. We've been using our imitation bottles to create realistic mosaic patterns. Playtime outside. We've had to be creative and think of new games to make sure we stick to our new extra essential golden rules. Here are some of the games we have created. After playtime, we sanitise our hands. We're allowed to sing outside, so we try to think of some fun songs to sing while we're waiting. Loving God, we pray for 
those who are suffering from coronavirus, may they know your healing power. When we are afraid, afraid of those and their loved ones, give us your strength and courage when we feel alone and isolated. Reassure us with the sense of your presence. Give wisdom to those in authority and may our community work together for the good of all. Give, give thanks to those who care for others and ask you to bless them in all they do. We ask this in the name of Jesus, healer and physician. Amen. Thank you for watching the COVID edition of our sharing assembly.